Hello musicians, this video is all about how to read rhythms in compound meter with do and do da di. I will share my screen so you can see what they look like. I know for some people we can't always see what they look like when we're on Zoom and sometimes we miss Zoom, especially when we have that nine o'clock Zoom that can be really hard to get out of bed for. So I wanted to make sure to share a video with you so you could all see how to read rhythms with do and do daddy. Our learning target when we're learning these is I will learn to read rhythms in compound meter. So reading means we have to have our eyes on the screen. We have to be looking at what the rhythms are. Our success criteria, I can read rhythms with do and do daddy. And when we do our assessment, I'm gonna give you the option to either say do or do daddy or let you clap do and do daddy or drum or tap do and do daddy. So I'll be demonstrating how to do those with these rhythms as well. I'll use rhythm syllables as well as my body percussion. So when we're in compound meter and we have do, do looks like this. It has a little dot with it called a dotted quarter note. And that's just telling us there's an extra part to the do. It's carrying an extra part with it. And that's because our beat has three parts, do, da, di. So this rhythm says do, do, da, di, do, do. If I clap that, it sounds like this. Do, do, da, di, do, do. Let's go on to our next one. Remember when we're reading rhythms, it does not matter if the stem is pointing up or down, it still says the same thing, which makes it a little different than reading letters, but kind of nice because you don't have to worry about it. Just looking at the head, the shape of the circle. This rhythm says do, do, da, di, do, do, da, di. If I drum that, it goes like this. My next rhythm is this. Do, da, di, do, da, di, do, do. Do, da, di, do, do, da, di, do. I'm gonna give you four more rhythms. I'm going to give you a moment to think them through. I will count them out in my head. If you find that I'm not giving you enough time to figure them out, feel free to pause the video. Give yourself time to think. My next rhythm looks like this. Think it, say it to yourself. That says do da di, do da di, do da di, do. Think it, figure it out. Do, do da di, do da di, do. Same thing, figure it out for yourself. Do, da, di, do, do, do. And our last one. Do, 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 da, di, do. That was a brief rundown of how to read compound meter rhythms with do and do, da, di. We will be having an assessment on this very soon. So practice to yourself. I will also upload the document with just these rhythms written out so you can look at them in practice. Our options are only do and do da di for this assessment. So we should all feel really confident with being able to read them. I hope you were successful. Now just keep practicing and let me know that you need help. Most important thing you can do for yourself when we're learning, especially when we're learning from home, but even in school, is to ask questions and let me know when you don't understand. Whether that means you have your families, have your grown up send me an email, whether you send me an email, send me a message on Canvas, write in the chat when I come in, like, hey, I'm really confused about reading rhythms, and I will do my best to help you. But if you're not communicating with me, I don't know that you need help. And I really want to be here to help you. So that's why I'm making these videos, and I hope they help you out. I'll see you in class very soon.